In today's tutorial, we are going to see how we can achieve amazing VFX like this just by a click that you with a free software. So it's going to be a lot of fun and I'm going to deep dive into each and every feature of this software. So make sure you stick around with me till the end and for now let's begin with the tutorial. Step one, go to wiggle.ai and then go to this join beta option. This will lead you to the Discord server like so. So you'll have to accept the invitation and you will be directed inside the server. Now here in the left hand side, you can get this wiggle server here under it. There are so many rooms, right? You can join in any of these rooms. So let me show you what five types of VFX or animation we can achieve. Number one, we can achieve mix, animate, where we can animate an image. We can go to character. We can stylize an image and ideate. I'm going to show you all these five options. Tip one, mix. So for this feature, we will have to go to this message box. First, join in any of these rooms. I have joined in animate two and then come to this message section and give forward slash and now you will have to select mix okay there are two things you need to select here one is one image for this i am using one image i am using this image and open and here you will have to drop one video for this i'll go to this video option and i will select one video now here you'll have to choose a background either white or green i'm choosing green background because it is easy to remove then for fine, fine tune option you will you should keep it on and then just press enter and let it create its magic. You can see Backpay Media is being highlighted. So now this is the final result from this image and this video. Okay. And if you like it, then go ahead and download it from here. Now we will be animating for one image by prompt. So for that, I will come here in the message section. I will have to go for slash and select this animate option. Here you just need one image. So I'll just go ahead and um, get my image here. I will take this image, open. Now give a prompt. I will give break dance or only break dance. The background, again, I would like to go for a green background. Now fine tune, definitely go for fine tune double on and enter and let's see how this turns out to be next step we will we will be giving this forward slash here and next is id it here, both the things you'll have to give for prompt. The image also you'll have to create by prompt and the motion also. Here I'm giving. I have given this short prompt of dancing. Background, I would like to go for green background. And here, fine tune model should be on. And go ahead and generate it. Look, this is how they have created the image out of my prompt. And this is how. The video has generated. So I'm just going to accept this. Open in browser if you want to have the image also. Just open it in browser, right click and save the image as in the desktop. Here I will give slash character. Okay, so I'll take this one. I will have to give an image prompt. So I have described a beautiful girl in sports vest and enter. Okay, from create image, I have got all these four images. So if you want to uh, use any of these images, choose a character. So I'm going to choose the third one. So I'll go to P3, okay? Now I'll simply go to wiggle this option, okay? I'll have to give a motion prompt. I'll give dance again. And fine tune model should be on. Background should be one because that is a green background and submit. So this is going to be where uh, I will see the dance motion. Open in browser, right click, save the image as, and then come here back and download the video. 
so this is how you can animate and create an image and then animate it further now let us move forward to the next feature which is stylize give forward slash and then you will get this stylize option here you will have to select one image now i'll have to give the image prompt and then i will go enter okay i have got four images these four images i like this last one so what i'll do is i'll go to this p4 option and then i will go to this wiggle this option okay here again i'll have to give a text prompt and here i'll have to give on okay and submit so this is my final result for creating the vfx you need to have the source video so i'm going to uh, use this source video the first step is go to app.runwayml.com and here we are going to use a free account you can see i am using a free account only so i will go edit video option in the left hand side and there i will have to go for in painting option because i need to get the same background but removing the subject so for this you'll have to go to this upload file option and select the file i have already selected the same so just bring it on the canvas it might take a little while to process the entire video and bring it here now once the preview is ready go and add it to the timeline now see my video is uploaded to the timeline now i have two options either include or exclude select the include option and just adjust the brush size from here so that you can comfortably cover the area which you don't want to be in the video okay now once this is done go to this export button 720 pixel would be the highest resolution which you can afford on a free account if you want 10 1080 pixel then you'll have to upgrade so at this moment we are going to uh, use 720 pixel only mp4 format and export the video so we will be using this background in order to replace the background so that the similar background is being shown i will go to my discord server and here i will type forward slash mix it is a very simple process i need one image and one video so my video file is already ready right so i will take this any image whichever you want to get replaced okay so i'm taking this image now i just need a background always take green background and always give the fine tune model on and enter that's it so now i what i'll do my output is ready once it is ready i'll just go ahead and download it now the final editing part i will be you can use any basic video editing software but i'm going to use filmora 12 now i have opened filmora 12 i will keep 16 is to 9 selected and open a new project here i just need three files one is this background file first i will take this file on top then go to this plus button add a video track bring it on the topmost layer and bring this at the bottom layer okay now select the b roll okay the topmost rail uh, this this stack is called b roll so i'll select this video edit option okay now here go to ai tool and go to chrome okay now you can just uh, increase or decrease the offset if you feel it's not looking that good you can just change the transparency and uh, tolerance and offset i need to export this file If you want to know different models, different AI tools, please do visit www.vagpaymedia.in, where we have created a comprehensive course for you all, which is getting an early bird offer as well at this moment. So, guys, if you like this video, please, please, please do subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet, and please consider to give me a like. One small request: please do share my content with. your friends and family so that i can thrive in every single day to create new videos like this for you all 
Thank you so very much for staying here with me. I'll come back with some fun tutorial next week. Till then, stay safe and stay legendary.